both CISL and IFRS 9 are likely to result in greater period-to-period -period volatility of uh, provision. And this is due to a number of factors, but to summarize, incorporation of future condition, so incorporation of economic scenarios, as well as methodological components are, are likely to result in a greater period-to-period -period change. So it's not just the initial assessment of allowance for credit losses that matters for a given instrument. It's also uh, how likely is that amount uh, to change because uh, there are certainly uh, capital costs associated with uh, the changing level of provision. In an upcoming uh, article in Risk Perspectives, we explore this uh, topic. Um, how do we measure volatility in a portfolio and how do we measure volatility of allowance of individual instruments uh, to better manage uh, the overall uh, lending portfolio.